this is living agriculture with Yisarui Gareva Chibinga, your service provider. I welcome you once again to this channel where we share what we know, what we understand, and what we do. I thank you for watching our channel. The channel is called Living Agriculture. It is a channel where you get the skills, you get the information, and you get the knowledge as to become your own farm manager and veterinary officer. I always say that it is you yourself who need to be what you want to be. Some people think that to manage a farm, it is always required to be having a farm manager there. Ned, this time, our content is to empower you to become self-reliant by doing it yourself. Because what we share with you, it is what you need. Let me be open to you. This would be the work of the government. But they have that content. They don't have that content to share with you who are viewing now. I thank those who are, are on our platform still called Living Agriculture. Thank you for sure sharing your views, giving us your ideas. Let me tell you this, and even I posted it. You can use the language you feel comfortable. Because this will me rule your gala. If it is a voicemail or voice message, I thank that one who is from Western, meaning there are some other people there who can understand in Rutoro other than Luganda or English. Thank you very much. If you can use Rusoga, use that. If you can use Rugwara, Rugbara, use that. Provided that you translate it. And we are very lucky that the language you use, it can be translated using Google. Today, we are going to handle Rabitre Enterprise or Project. Before going into the Rabitre Project, you have to master four factors. One, you should have the shelter where to keep these rabbits. Two, you should have the choice. When I talk of the choice, the breeds. Three, you should have the capacity of identifying the common diseases in rabbits. The last one is treating and feeding them. Let me remind you again. You are watching, living agriculture. With me, Sarui Garibachi Vinga, the only one who came out with Brian Mutebi to see that we share what you need to share. One time, one day, when government I will, you will not hesitate. And I know you can do that. <laughs> our mobile numbers, are, our phones are on the mobile network. Now, when we talk of the types, of breeds in rabbits some people have the local one some have the crossed one some have the original western hybrid so today we are going just to look at a few of them of which you know them and of which you have ever seen them. The first one, it is called the New Zealand white. This one, it's white. It may be multicolor, 
But what differentiates it, it is the eyes. There are some with the pink eyes. Some are with the red eyes. New Zealand, its weight, it weighs from 2.5 kilograms to 5 kilograms at 7 months. You have to note this that if you are to go into business and you need to sell them, they should not be below 3 kilograms and they should not be below 4 months. Those who need them, they start from 3 kilograms and they start from 4 months plus. That's New Zealand. Then still we have California. All these ones are white in color. Growth rate is okay. Birth rate is okay. The weight is okay. The third. No, the second is chinchilla. Chinchilla, it has a multicolor. You will see it. Black or white. Then California. California are always white. And in New Zealand. Then we have the the palm the Belgium giant. Honestly, this one is also it's in a multicolor characteristics. This is the most best rabbit breed. Its weight ranges from four kilograms to seven kilograms. Kazitowa this giant and to get these kilograms to seven it should be six to nine months to get this weight and it will be funny a kilogram of rabbit if it is well fed it ranges from eighteen thousand to 20,000 per kilo. Cut one, you need to know if at all I have 10 rabbits and each weighs 4 kilograms at 20,000. Because here we need to be calculative. What we need to go into a project and of which this project you can benefit from it now the last one not least it is a palomino this one it is in grayish color and you will see all of them because what we need is you to go into a project which you understand to go into a project you can manage to go into a project which you can feed. Now, the biggest challenge is you who is viewing. I know there are some who have, have already started or they had started this project through other companies which came out to say that they were helping you. Well, they did not tell you how to treat them using the herbal medicine. The reason why they lost the market, it came from the chemical medicine you use. Because you inject it and you slaughter it. Honestly, let me be open to you. I'm a deserted medical clinical officer. Nasura wobu sawo waba and two. That's why you are benefiting from me. And the disadvantage of, of my government doesn't support us. Who are viewing? But I don't know when 
you will come out to support people like us who work for the government and you are in government and you are paid and you cannot come out to help us. And you would desire to be conducting these workshops on the ground. It is not all that every person at the grassroots there have the capacity of having the smartphones. Mutuyambe mwechi into chimu muavandaba. Mutugambi de kubanena basabolo to take a muku sente. To so mesabantu on the ground. But if you cannot do that, we shall remain on the social media. Because if we talk of organizing a workshop, one, we need to pass the advertisements on, on several radio stations. Two, we need to pass adverts on televisions. Three, we have to hire for a hall. Thirdly, the people who will be coming to train our farmers have to be facilitated. Kati Gwanda basoka webuze. Omuntu wa wansi gwe tujamu obululu. Omuntu wa wansi gwe tujamu omusoro. Because if he or he buys the salt, there is tax there. But sugar, there is salt there. Buys the soap, there is tax there. To buy yambia to tia. Echo chichi singo kunkoza. And some people complain. Yes, I will continue saying this because I normally talk this. These are honest conversations. They are honest but uncomfortable to most of the people there. Because I do this because I love my country. I do this because I like my people. And I do this to embrace what we call parish development model. To support the government programs in fighting poverty. But for you who is viewing now, what have you done? And one time one day, I may call for support. But who is viewing? Are you ready to support us? Because this worker is entitled to be for the government. And the veterinary officers who are paid at the district level. The veterinary officers who are paid at the sub-county levels. But if I may ask, when do they work? Where do they work? And how do they work? Even in 12, Abasawa Abali Ko District, Mukola D, Mukola Chi, Era Mukola Wa. And to make it worse, you are facilitated. Mufuno musara, mufuna alawensi, bulichimune entambula mulina. But you have never thought of reaching the ground to help the layman to fight poverty. Muli woko kunganya musara gwa mwene musirika. That's why we came out with this platform, Living Agriculture. I thank those who appreciate what we, we give you. Those who are from Israel, those who are from Russia, we have this one from Canada, have this one from Germany, from Russia, USA, California, across the world. What do you do once you come across this platform? Share it. Like it and share it. Orwen songa, chetu no nye chiri e chintu chimu. Gwatulaba, how do you benefit? I always talk of this. And some people say, njogera bubi. Okay, I accept that. Neye muli mwa abantu abamu. Nga naturally, they are like a motorcycles. If you don't kick them, honestly, they cannot start. Katifatu yise wano. The government will realize that we, what we are doing is important to the community. But ya kuvayo batu wagire. Ne mutu wagira muchi. What we need is supporting us in organizing these workshops. Two, we need to have a demonstration farm. Ngabulichimu kwe chiri. If it needs a pigare, ngaweziri. 
If it means rabbit si nga weburi. If it means cows nga weziri. If it means goats nga weziri. If it means chicken or poultry nga weziri. We promise you here on living agriculture. Honestly, this is the platform for helping the farmers. Temoteka kobi abusiru. Because if you want to post what you want, if it, is, it does not follow in agriculture, try another platform or social media, not here. We said, Obangambie, these are the common breeds of rabbits. Obomiubu no. There is a standby market in Gwandaba, a Yobomiu. But the disadvantage is how do you treat them? Let me be open to you. We have lost the market in everything in Africa here and basically in Uganda here because you treat your animals using chemical medicine. I'm not fighting the chemical medicine but the way how you use them in terms of administering them, chechizivu. Every animal you inject or you treat, it must take three weeks. Ngatona jisala. Neyani ya inobu funa anjizivu. And you can be in that position. Okulaba ante chisolo cho janja bie. Chitu wala weeks isatu ongateba na chisala. Last time I talked about cattle. Diary milk, diary cows. You spray in the morning, you milk in the night, in the evening. You spray in the evening, you milk in the morning. All the milk you take and you will be supplying will become contaminated. By the medicine is sprayed against the ticks. And I have to be honest with you. Two. Let me apologize to those who normally calls me. Mbagamba mwechi into Timwanda times you call Brian. Don't call him at night. To be remu. It is only me. Go kubire chiro. Kuba during day time. I'm always busy. Working my other work. Na ye chiro mbeira settled. So we need to know about that. And if you call and I don't pick. Send a text message. To yomba. Mwini mwaba mwaba ono nefu. Na kukubile simu na gambo. Limu siru. What do I call you and you don't pick? When you approach me in that format, I will block you. Echo chenja gala tumanye. This platform is for well-disciplined person. Tekuli kubi achifere. If it comes to crop production in Nabagamba, it's called Ibula. Oyeriko Ali, 24-7. It's called Dibula Ruigale. Just talk to him. Whatever you need in crops production, Ajakuyamba. And if it comes to animals, hey, we can share that. Kuba, what you need, it is what we want you to have. We need to share with you what helps you. Because once you are done, the government will get money. And if everything is done the way I expect it to be, but if you have not done what I expect you to do, I will continue training you on this social media because what we need is to see that, honestly speaking, we need you to be empowered. If you are empowered, that's our pleasure and that's our pride. Obumiu, let me give you this. Because we have the diseases of which Njagala to know that. But before going into that, let's see how the rabbit house can be constructed. That's the first thing. Now, always Mark this. Every rabbit's house should be constructed 
in a manner that it has enough light. It should be constructed in a manner that it has enough air. Obumiobukuru tebwagala nzikiza. They should not stay in a darkness. That you have to mark a that. And it could be better to be put in cages. If you cannot afford in cage form, we have other means. But normally, we never put your rabbit on the floor or on the ground. And you will come across diseases due to this darkness of the environment. They are supposed to be on a floor whereby its waste just passes through. Obumiyobu no tubu rundanga bulina kubeira mokeji. It is urine, assuming this is the floor. If they are here, the waste passes down and comes down here. The urine itself works in two but one, it works as the medicine for the plants. Two, these are fertilizers. Katigwarundo of mu mark this. Urine is a medicine for the plants. And even its droppings, it is used for fertilizing our plants or crops. Never mix. Or put your rabbits on the ground one see no put them on the cage such that every wastage it passes through because some of you what you do you just dump there the feeds you just dump there the greens or the plants for feeding them they urinate on them they defecate on them and finally eat them Bugenda Kurwara. And you will complain that the vet who is whom you are using doesn't work. And even you veterinary officers, if you normally visit these farmers, at least be sensible enough to advise them to know how these cages or their houses are constructed. See, because you are to be paid. It is very bad. So, the shelter of the house. As you see them, they should be constructed in a way that the feeds are not put on the ground. There are some pots where we, we put the feeds, and we have the pots where we put water. And some, they use nipples for feeding or for taking water. You are on living agriculture. With me, Sarui Gareva Chivinga. I thank you very much for liking this channel because the broad objective of this channel is to empower you to stand on your own feet and fight poverty through our channel here. Because once you reach our channel and you take time to view what we tell you, you will not remain the way as you are. Because it is an open channel. Most of you, you take time on watching drama on your TVs. Oine yebu zambu alimukula babu zanyo. Na inga nobu zanyo wala batabuli na chebu muongera ko. You will have the smartphone. It is just a matter of having your data. Look for living agriculture. It is going to help you. And even you help your people. There is Madame Musmenta at Entebbe there. Thank you for watching this channel. And sharing this channel with your people. Honestly. I like that. And one time one day I will desire to visit your people there. And see what we do. Because you put on a screen such that every person who is there views what we are saying and hears what we are saying. Thank you very much. And the madam who is in Israel there, you normally tell me, if it comes to 
watching there is no any other channel you are interested in like a living agriculture thank you very much my brothers in dubai in malaysia in indonesia in uk in ukraine in russia usa germany nigeria kenya and my friend in rwanda brother there I thank you for watching Living Agriculture Channel, where we share what we need you to know. Because honestly, this Uganda of ours, or this world of ours, we need self reliance. But how can you get that? It is requiring the knowledge and the skill. Because I said it before. These government employees are salary earners, not service providers. But the community, what they need is service delivery. We have several TV channels here. But you find that instead of putting or showing what helps the community, which is okay. You find that most of the time they put music. So, ladies and gentlemen, what I need, we share what we want. If it is rabbits, go into rabbits. How do you feed them? What breed? What are the common diseases? How do you handle these diseases? How do you treat them? Honestly, because I pray one thing. If God can grant me two more years, I 